Let's jump into the Camellia Bowl, 4.30 p.m. Central Time on ESPN, Saturday, December 15th. It's in Montgomery, Alabama. Can you believe they got a bowl game in Montgomery? No. I mean, that's just crazy to me. Just crazy. It's Georgia Southern and Eastern Michigan. Georgia Southern 9-3 and three this year. They are 9-3 and three against the spread. Eastern Michigan 7-5 and five this year. They are 7-5 and five against the spread. <laughs> Pretty crazy, right? They win, they cover. Yep. Uh, Georgia Southern 2-2 two and two against the spread in their last four. Eastern Michigan was 1-3 against the spread. It opened as a pick em. It is currently Georgia Southern minus 1. Uh, we are recording this on Sunday, December the 9th, so this line will change. So if you're going down to Tunica, Mississippi, you need to go on and, and make sure you got the right line. We'll just say that. Um, the metrics will tell you that Eastern Michigan should be favored by .26 points. Yeah, and uh, and the point total, it says it should be 47. The the total uh, the Vegas total is 47 and a half. So, yeah. Um, again, Georgia Southern runs a triple option. Not a lot of time to prep for it, but Eastern Michigan has played Army, and they've they've done it a few times this year. Where this won't be play. their first time seeing it. No, you got that right. So, uh, I mean, Chris Creighton from Eastern Michigan, fantastic coach. Uh, he took a program that was nothing and has done really good things with it. Chad Lunsford, Georgia State. Uh, look, they, they fired a guy last year that did not understand what it is down in Statesboro, right? Like it, they, Georgia Southern is a triple option team. Correct. They always have been. That is their culture. That is what they do. That's what they want to do. Yeah, and and their former coach tried to move them out of it. And what was he his got, name? Tyson Summers. He got, he got replaced. Name? Yeah, he got replaced. Chad Lunsford comes in, immediately goes back to the triple option. They go nine and three. It's like, okay, it's well, pretty we, fantastic. We knew what, what we were doing. Uh, these guys are are. Pretty even across the board, points per game. I mean, this is a coin. Uh, I mean, I'm literally flipping a coin here. Now, I, I'll, I'll point this out to you. So, there's the Massey strength of schedule, okay. which Georgia Southern played the number 117 strength of schedule, and Eastern Michigan played number 98. But the turnover margin, that is the biggest thing for me. Georgia Southern plus 22 on the year. They lead the country in turnover margin. Eastern Michigan plus 10. The, see the now both of them are still getting turnovers. The, the plus twenty, the triple option teams just don't lose the ball very often. That's a good thing. I I get it, but you're you're looking at what they did over the course of the year. If the other team doesn't lose the ball very often, I don't know. I, I'm going that way. I like Georgia Southern. I'm going to take that. It's literally just a clip of uh, flip of the coin. Um, and and I would take the under just because. I think they can limit possessions, have long, sustainable drives that end in touchdowns. That's I'm so we're we're literally doing the same thing. I'm, yeah. We're both taking Georgia Southern, and we are rolling with the under forty seven and a half. Okay. All right, I like that. I like that. Da, da, da. All right, next one up. 